Hey guys, what's up? It's been a minute. What's up? How you doing? Welcome back to my channel. My name is Laura. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, and share all my videos. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. Okay, so today, mm, updates on life, right? <laughs> Where do I start? First of all, I want to say, um, you guys know that I'm a very bubbly person. I'm a very lively person. I'm a very um happy go lucky person i like to have fun i like to make friends i like to travel i like to do all the stuff um i rarely get angry i do get angry sometimes but i rarely get angry and i never ever post any bitter or angry video online because that's not who i am and i don't want that to you know um define me basically so yeah life updates um okay um uh, i've been struggling with a lot of stuff i've been struggling with my life i've been struggling with um physical uh, as well as um psychological mm -hmm. i had my daughter in february 28th that was the last day in february and the pandemic started in march in fact we were preparing to come back to nigeria when the pandemic started um and you know we had to stay back in america i was in america for uh, nine months plus um we were there we were eating playing praying to and i didn't think of my weight at that point so we oh. couldn't go to the gym we couldn't go to um i couldn't do anything with my body it was it was just you know in the house you eat you sleep you eat you sleep and then i added so much weight i'd never been that big in my entire life um, so we went to london i stayed in london for three months the same thing we are on lockdown there was no gym nothing so we were good i was still in the house even though i did a few shopping <laughs> you know but so i said when i get to nigeria i would you know go to the gym i didn't do that because as soon as i got to nigeria i had so many jobs so many influencing jobs and then i was working on my store so there was no time it, it got to me because i used to be like a, a fitness coach i used to train people i used to help people lose weight i used to help people be be physically um you know strong i used to help people you know achieve all that and then i'm having that problem it just weighed me down you know when you are not physically very very confident you, it will affect you emotionally and psychologically and that i think that's what happened to me you know how people go through stuff and then they find solace in drinking or smoking or <laughs> hanging or partying or whatever i do not smoke i do not drink i don't party so basically what i've been doing lately is shopping um so i shop for things that i don't need i shop for things that i need i just shop because it makes me happy mm -hmm. but i've been considering botox um and i booked you know to get botox done um i haven't um there's this thing that they call contour where you contour your face and da da da, da. i haven't tried it before yeah you know i've considered it and i've booked for it um i am trying new stuff you know with my body i'm trying new routines i'm trying to i'm going th through another route to get my body down uh, i never look at people's body like it's always been laura 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 but these days i look at people i'm like ah i should look like this i'm considering lipo i never yes i always talked about lipo 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 but i've never ever you know thought of actually going to the doctor's place to pay for like but now i'm considering it um i won't lie to you i'm just telling you what i've been considering lately um i told you guys about my nose i'm doing something about my nose too um so hopefully before my birthday all these things will come together I yeah mean, that's that in terms of finance i'm still good i'm still getting jobs um i'm still doing well my makeup sold out things are great on that side in terms of relationship i'm good you guys know i'm married uh, my husband is working right now. We're good, no quarrels, nothing. So there's really no story about that part of my life. Um, I wish it was more exciting. Hopefully, to be more exciting soon. Um, you know, you know how exciting that you want your marriage to be. Uh, so hopefully that will happen soon. Uh, my store, yeah, my store. I've been working. I think that's that's another problem that I have that has been weighing me down. Um, I came back all my things. I bought all my clothes to sell. In fact, that some of them are going out of um, style. 
um so i brought a lot of stuff when i came back in september they're still in the store um i'm having problems with um the space so i'm looking for another space so let me tell you the story right so i paid for a space before i went to have my baby in the u.s so we moved from where i was before um to the new space and then the pandemic happened everything shut down um, I couldn't go to the store. Of course, I was in the U.S., so I couldn't even go. My mom, who is the manager of my store, who manages all, you know, everything about the gang, could not go out because she's, you know, she's an elderly. Um, so the store was there for close to a year, and we didn't use it at all. Um, and I came back, and I told the guy, look, listen, we haven't used this store for a year, um, and I have paid, uh, you know, the reason why we could not use the store because of the pandemic and blah 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 and I have two months left in my rent and um and I have two more and I have two months left on the rent and I was uh, asking him if you could you know just extend it he said no blah 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 I just felt like it was unfair so we're going back and forth and if you know me I don't like Wahala so I told my mom look we're gonna look for another space and move our stuff because really I didn't like the space before I didn't choose it because I was in Nigeria but it's not my vibe so we've been looking for a new space things are hard um, in terms of looking for spaces you want a space that works with your vibe I want space so I can dance so I can attend to people um, I want you know where you can change your clothes so I just want the whole thing we've not gotten that yet and also we're trying to build a space uh, for my store, I'm tired of paying rent. I'm tired of begging people for. I just wanted my own space, and getting the land was a problem. We were going from Alausa, so it was just a lot of work. And then, you know, this one is trying to collect money from you. This one is extorting money for you from you just because you want to build something that would benefit all, us all. Right I mean, so that's life updates you know um hopefully i'll be able to update you more and tell you what i've been up to while i do other content you know so yeah that's where i am right now so don't forget to subscribe peace out love you Mwah.